Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. So today is going to be a mini brow tutorial. So as you can see I have already done my face so this video is solely going to be just on my brows. I have gone on a bit of a brow journey, I'm not going to lie. I'm really really happy with the way that my brows look at the minute and it literally just uses two products. It uses a bar of soap and a little brow pencil. But if you want to see how I do my eyebrows, then just keep on watching. Okay, so I have zoomed you in just so you can see what I'm going to be doing. So I am just going to take my Pears Transparent Soap. And what I'm going to do is I'm basically going to... Sorry for the rustling. I'm basically going to wet the bar of soap with some Fix Plus and then I'm going to run a spoolie through it. Now you want to make sure that the product is not too wet but also not too dry but you can see oh oh no it's a it's a little bit wet so we're just going to take our spoolie this is just the end of the nyx micro brow pencil and i'm literally just going to run it through like that so you've built up so <clears throat> so you've built up some product like that now I'm just going to let that sit for a bit in the spoolie and then I'm going to take the other end. I also really want to apologise if you can hear shouting in the background downstairs are listening to sport and then just not being very considerate. <laughs> so what I'm going to do is I'm going to take a clean spoolie. So this, this is the one that has no soap on it. This is the one that does have soap on it. And just with a clean brush, I'm just going to brush the brows where I want them to go. And then... With the end of the pencil, I'm just going to slightly just draw underneath my brow. Now, I'm being really, really light-handed with this because I want to make my eyebrows look as natural as possible. So, I'm just filling in the areas that need a little bit of help. So, it's all kind of one colour, if that makes sense. I only really kind of focus the product on my arch and the beginning because I've got quite thick brows like in the middle here. I don't really need to put that much product in so I kind of just leave it really. And then just flicking the product up. So I've got a bit of a beginning of a brow because it's, they just need a little bit of help, you know? So now that I have drawn out where my eyebrow needs help so it looks a bit fuller. I'm just going to take the spoolie with the soap on it and I'm just going to brush upwards. Now the reason why I've switched over to soap is I feel like it holds the brow so much more than like an actual eyebrow gel. Like I feel like my brows don't move when I use this. You can go as fluffy as you like. Obviously the fluffy you want, the more you want them to kind of stick out but it's only really the front that I want to be fluffy so it looks a bit like that and now to do the same on the other side so I did just brush through my brow with a clear spoolie and then I'm just going to take my pencil again Now this eyebrow arch is a lot more sparse, so I do actually draw it another line. Just because my tail isn't as thick on this side as it is this side, so I do need to draw a lot more. And then again, just flicking it up like so when you're happy with it just take your spoolie with your soap in it 
and brush upwards. So it's looking a bit like that. I've really been enjoying how my brows look with this. I used to be quite heavy handed with my eyebrows. I used to use, I mean, I've used all sorts to be fair. So now that the brows are done, I'm just gonna zoom you out and end the video. So as you can see, it was a really quick and easy way on how I do my brows. So I do actually love the way these make my brows look. I feel like they look, look a lot more natural now. But yeah, I get so many compliments and I feel like the soap really helps set the eyebrows so much more compared to like an eyebrow gel. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed this quick mini video and I'll see you in my next one.